Here we are going to start with a new topic that is circles. Very first of all, we are going to learn the basic things of the circle and they are Suppose we are having this one as a circle. So this is the center of the circle and the line which joins the center to the point on the circle is known as radius of the circle. Then if we join any two points on the circle, suppose this one be P and this one be Q, then this is known as chord of the circle. And if the chord is passing through the center, if it is passing through the center, then this chord is known as diameter of a circle. So we can also say that diameter is the longest chord of the circle. Now the circle divides the plane into three regions that is interior of the circle, exterior of the circle and on the circle. So the circle divides the plane into three parts that is interior of the circle, exterior of the circle and on the circle. Now if we have a line which touch the circle at a single point and pass away, then this line is known as tangent of the circle. And if you are having a line which passes through the circle by cutting at two point, this is known as secant of the circle. Now we are having some properties of a tangent. Suppose we are having a circle, then from any exterior point P, if we draw two tangents, let this one be PA and PB. Then this PA is equal to PB. Tangent from any external point P to the circle is always of equal length. That is PA equals to PB. And if we are having a center as O, then the angle with a radius to this tangent is always perpendicular. That is angle P A O is always of 90 degree. But if we make a point P se hum do tangent in the circle, then the two tangent ki length will be equal. And if we make a point P se radius ke through is tangent pe angle, banayenge, to wahan pe 90 degree. Hoga. That is tangent is always perpendicular to the radius of the circle. Now suppose if you have a circle in which we have taken two points, let this one be A and this one be B. So this portion, this is known as the arc, arc of this circle. And this will also be an arc. Now this is small, so that's why we call it minor arc. And this one is greater, so this is known as major arc. और अगर ये सेंटर के थ्रू दो रेडियस बना के हम लोग करते हैं देन दिस इज नोन एज सेक्टर दिस इज माइनर सेक्टर एंड दिस रीजन इज नोन एज मेजर सेक्टर सो द सेक्टर इन द रीजन व्हिच इज डिवाइडेड बाय अ सर्कल थ्रू अ रेडियस ऑफ द सर्कल देन इफ यू आर हैविंग अ सर्कल एंड इज डिवाइडेड बाय अ कॉर्ड अगर एक कॉर्ड के थ्रू डिवाइड होता है so this makes a segment or a chota segment hai, so this is minor segment and this one is greater so this is major segment then at last we have if we are having a diameter then this diameter divides the circle into two equal semicircles and if we make any angle in a semicircle then that is of 90 degree. So we can say angle in a semicircle is of 90 degree. Now let's begin with exercise 15. Now let's see question number one. Here we have draw a circle with a center O and the radius 2.5 centimeter. Draw two radii OA and OB such that AOB is of 60 degree. We have to measure the length of the chord AB. Now here we have to draw a circle of radius 2.5 centimeter. Very first of all, we are going to draw a line of 2.5 centimeter by the help of scale. Let this one be O and 
दिस विल बी ए ये हम लोग स्केल से बनाएंगे दैट इज ऑफ 2.5 सेंटीमीटर देन टेकिंग दिस वन एज रेडियस वी आर गोइंग टू कंप्लीट दिस होल सर्किल और ये सर्किल कंप्लीट करने के बाद विल बी हैविंग दिस वन एज द रेडियस देन वी हैव टू फॉर्म अ एंगल ऑफ 60 डिग्री एज ए ओ बी तो हमें बी एक और पॉइंट पाए चाहिए तो जो हमने आर्क यहां से यहां तक लिया है उसी को फॉलो करेंगे विदाउट चेंजिंग इट वी आर गोइंग टू पुट द आर्क एट ए और फिर इसको यहां से ऐसे कट करेंगे आई रिपीट जो आर्क हमने यहां से लिया है उसको यहां पे रखेंगे और फिर इसे कट करेंगे जहां पे ये कट करेगा दैट विल बी ओ बी पॉइंट और इसको हम लोग इसे ज्वाइन करेंगे एंड दिस विल बी ऑफ 60 डिग्री एंड हेंस दिस इज द रिक्वायर्ड फिगर आस्ट इन द क्वेश्चन नंबर 1 नाउ लेट्स डू क्वेश्चन नंबर 2 हियर इन दिस क्वेश्चन वी हैव ड्रॉ अ सर्कल ऑफ रेडियस 3.2 सेंटीमीटर देन ड्रॉ अ कॉर्ड ए बी ऑफ द सर्कल सच दैट ए बी इज 5 सेंटीमीटर सेट द माइनर सेगमेंट ऑफ द सर्कल here again we have a radius of the circle as 3.2 cm so 3.2 cm ka hum log ek line banayenge that will be treated as the radius of the circle then we are going to put the compass over here and the pencil over here and going to complete this whole circle and on completing we will be getting a circle with the radius o a then we have to form a chord of 5 cm to uske liye hum 5 cm ka compass set karenge 5 सेंटीमीटर कंपास सेट करने के बाद वी आर गोइंग टू पुट द कंपास एट ए एंड वी आर गोइंग टू मेक एन आर्क लाइक दिस जहां पे भी ये कट करेगा दैट विल बी द पॉइंट बी और हम इसको इससे जब ज्वाइन करेंगे देन विल बी गेटिंग द कॉर्ड ऑफ 5 सेंटीमीटर दिस इज द रिक्वायर्ड फिगर ऑफ द क्वेश्चन नंबर 2 नाउ लेट्स डू क्वेश्चन नंबर 3 हियर इन क्वेश्चन नंबर 3 वी हैव find the length of the tangent drawn to a circle of radius 3 cm from a point at the distance of 5 cm from the center now here we have got this figure as the information given in the question we are having a point a which is 5 cm away from the center and the radius of the circle is 3 cm and we have to find the length of the tangent let this one be ab o and we know the tangent is perpendicular to the radius therefore we are having 90 डिग्री एट द पॉइंट ऑफ इंटरसेक्शन सो हियर ए बी ओ इक्वल टू 90 डिग्री एज टेंजेंट इज परपेंडिकुलर टू द रेडियस एट द पॉइंट ऑफ इंटरसेक्शन नाउ एज़ वी आर हैविंग अ 90 डिग्री ओवर हियर सो दिस इज अ राइट एंगल्ड ट्रायंगल एंड एज़ इट इज अ राइट एंगल्ड ट्रायंगल वी कैन अप्लाई पाइथागोरस थ्योरम एंड बाय पाइथागोरस थ्योरम वी विल बी एबल टू फाइंड आउट दिस ए बी सो हियर बाय पाइथागोरस थ्योरम वी गेट ए ओ स्क्वायर इक्वल टू ए बी स्क्वायर प्लस बी ओ स्क्वायर and here ao square is 5 square that is equals to ab square plus bo we are having 3 square and here we get ab square equals to 5 square minus 3 square and that is ab square is 25 minus 9 that is equals to 16 and that implies ab equals to the root of 16 that is equals to 4 cm as answer Now let's move to question number four. Here in this question, we are having this figure, and the PT is a tangent of the circle with a center C. Given CP equals to 20 centimeter and PT equals to 16 centimeter, find the radius of the circle. So here, as PT is tangent and CT is the radius of the circle, therefore this angle will be of 90 degree. As the tangent is perpendicular to the radius at the point of intersection therefore angle ptc equals to 90 degree as tangent is perpendicular to the radius at the point of intersection now we are having 90 degree in triangle ptc therefore it is a right angle triangle and we can apply pythagoras theorem so by pythagoras theorem pc square equals to pt square plus ct square and here this pc square is 20 square pt square is 16 square plus ct square we have to find out therefore the ct square equals to 20 square minus 16 square that is equals to 400 minus 256 and here we get ct square equals to 144 and that implies ct equals to the root of 144 and this is 12 cm as answer That's all for this video. Thank you.